while we're talking about this world thing, I've reevaluated. And I think the thing that gets me more fired up about the Noah Lyles thing is the energy he came at it with. I don't think the sentiment, like if he wants yeah. to argue that is a little weird, but it's more like just the energy of like one signaling out the NBA uh -huh. and then being so like weird about it. I don't personally get it. I don't think it's wrong. I think it's weird, but like I get it to yeah. a certain extent. It's not like a logicless yeah. statement, See, but that's... the energy was the problem that I had. I agree. The thing that I will say, and I kind of wanted to talk about this again, but I didn't want to be annoying and do another episode about this again. But the thing I will say is the point that all these people on the camp of like saying he's right are all clinging on to is just annoying to me because it's like they're correct in the most meaningless way possible <laughs> you know what i mean yeah like they're like you are not wrong technically they are the champions of this domestic league so you can't say that you're the world champion it's like why are you the person who gets to define what world champion means you know what i mean mm -hmm. like shouldn't it be the best team out of the best athletes in the world at this sport you know, that's just annoying to me that why does that not constitute a world champion? And what does is some of the best players choosing to represent their country in a Olympic competition, because like not all the best players, like in this FIBA tournament, like we're talking about, Jokic isn't playing for Serbia. Giannis Chris isn't Epps. playing for Greece. Chris, Chris isn't Epps playing isn't for playing. Latvia. And then it's like Jason Tatum isn't playing for Team USA. AD yeah. isn't playing for Team USA. You know why? Because they're prioritizing the NBA. <laughs> That is why. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to bring that up because I don't, like, the argument, for lack of a better word, that he was making isn't, like, an illogical, like, dumb thing. But it's just the energy he came at it with, ignoring every other thing that does it, and then being right in the most meaningless way possible. Yeah, that's, I think that's the best way to put it. They're correct in the most meaningless way possible. If anything, like, this was a tweet I made a while ago, but I thought it was a good line to probably put in here in a podcast. Honestly, I think we could take it a step further and call them the galactic champions of the universe we don't know if monsters are real until there's somebody to contest it we can say it that's fair the galactic champions of the universe of the cosmos we'll say of the that. cosmos yeah the galactic champions of the cosmos no but watch it there's literally just like what if Giannis is an alien i'm pretty sure that there's already been like a like a, a, a cartoon based on this that like space nba jam? players are aliens no 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 no. space jam is like aliens absorb power of other nba players and then became yeah. so what are you talking about no i'm saying that like what if like Giannis is Giannis. an alien. And I'm saying Giannis because he's just like this physical specimen of like, I am basketball. I could have said anybody before somebody starts saying weird stuff because he's Greek. Anyway. Because <laughs> he's a Nigerian Greek alien. Has nothing to do with that at all. It is exclusively, he's just this specimen. Like if there's just like an entire planet full of Giannis's, they would kick the crap out of us in basketball. Probably. Yeah. Like respectively. But yeah. Um, what is the capital of Mozambique? 